this is your last chance. After this, there is no turning back. You take the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want. You take the red pill. You stay in Wonderland. And I show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. It is your boy, Inventor, down the rabbit hole network. This is the series I'm doing on the Milo motor, Milo magnetic motor replication. And this is about as far as I've gotten here. I have a bunch of ceramic magnets here, super glued onto this aluminum disc. And then I have two rectangle neodymiums that are just magnetically held on top of this of the ceramic magnets. So there's two neos on each ceramic magnet and then a ceramic magnet and I super glued them close enough to where they're creating like a rep repulsion effect and it's on north facing up and they're glued onto a they're glued onto a aluminum disc pretty thick one and I have a thrust bearing on the bottom that is glued to this table so you can see it spins pretty freely there I'm gonna go ahead and show you oh, and then this is the stator it's six ceramic magnets or excuse me nine ten actually ten ceramic magnets taped together some of them are actually glued together but some of them are taped together and then they're all taped together so that's the stator and then this is the, the armature got the mag that just made the magnet fall spinning it okay so what I figured out so far is this here this here It'll continuously spin if if I oh and I should also say that I did not get it to go in his in the way that how he shows in the video I could not get it to go with the north and the south facing down. What I have the only way that I've gotten this to work is flipping the north and the south 180 degrees. Let me set up this tripod. the north and the south 80 degrees I've gotten that to go for the most part because when you think about it I'll do a demonstration here shortly when you think about it the energy that you would waste for a small electronic to, to make it do the 180 degree flip you would still be getting more energy out of the system if it was hooked to some sort of generator you know like that are on the wind turbines how the wind spins that magnetic generator that's inside of there if you could make a magnetic generator spin you would still get way more energy out of the system than you put in to just flip the magnet 180 degrees that's not gonna cost more it's still gonna be over you know what i'm saying it's gonna it's gonna cost less energy to flip it 180 degrees you're gonna get more energy out of the system because it's going to be spinning and attached to a generator you see what I'm saying you're still going to get more energy out of the system so and also what I figured out is that you don't necessarily need to turn it 180 degrees you just need to get it about 80 or 90 degrees and it'll keep going enough so it doesn't so you don't hit a sticky spot you know what I'm saying like it would I'll just show you okay so this is more or less the 180 degree turn. Attraction, repulsion, attraction, repulsion, attraction, repulsion, attraction, repulsion. You see how that picks up speed? And I mean that's picking up a good amount of speed. Like I said before, it can still be over unity. 
30, 100 percent. It could still be over 100 percent. You could still get over unity out of this because that electronic that's going to make it do an 180 degree turn is not going to be using that much energy compared to the energy that you're pulling out of the system if you were to hook this up to some form of magnetic generator like, a, like how the wind turbine except instead of the wind the, the stator would be turning the armature so as you can see it picks up speed it keeps going it keeps going it keeps going that's more or less than 180 degree turn and I'm investing in crypto and you know having my daily life so I can't do this all the time that's why I haven't stepped up my game and got it in like a small electronic to do the turning but I am gonna do that very soon I just wanted to update you guys with I did do this this has been sitting here for gosh I don't know maybe two three weeks I just have a life too also you know I need to make money and invest and try to make more money because nobody's gonna fund this type of stuff if they just buy it out so hopefully I don't get copyrighted with this uh, music here but okay now I'll show you the more or less the 90 degree turn where it doesn't need to go 180 degrees it just needs to it just needs to get off of the attraction and repulsion so it could keep going without attracting back to itself and and essentially hitting a sticky spot you know like because if you just let it go it'll hit a sticky spot here because see how it just wants to push it back on itself so that's what the whole turn is when you turn it, it starts to repulse and then you turn it back and it starts to attract and then you turn it repulsion turn it back attraction and you turn it repulsion and then you turn it back attraction so milo definitely had definitely was on to something because on his design you already have north and south facing down so you don't have to do the turn you know what i'm saying because it's already in in a type of pattern where it would be attracting and repulsing essentially without having a turn and that's the same thing howard johnson was talking about the the u-shaped magnet that it's already attracting and repulsing in one direction but i could not I don't understand the technicals behind that side to get it to move in that manner, but I'm, I'm sure that, that you can get it to go in that manner. And I don't know if I said already, but the bottom of this aluminum plate is on a thrust bearing and the thrust bearing is glued to this table. Like what? on the sides, I forget what you call it, but the poles are on the sides. Okay, so, uh, yeah, just an update here. And enter down the rabbit hole network here. I believe this would work 100% with a little more effort put into it. Just to get, to get the stator to electronically turn on its own. It doesn't necessarily have to do 180, it just has to do, just has to get off of the attraction and repulsion and it'll continue gliding. So if you guys want me to continue this series, let me know in the comments down below. Hit that bell icon, subscribe, and uh, yeah man, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm not done with this, I will continue doing this until I have a breakthrough. I enjoy the, the all magnetic motors and I enjoy the electromagnetic motors. So yeah, peace out man. Like, subscribe, comment down below.